This video is dedicated to Borzikman's patron and friend Robert. Dear Robert, you asked Borzikman to make a video on this topic and he fulfilled your request. Thank you for your loyalty and support. Greetings my dear truth seekers. The fact that the world was divided into two camps became clear a few hours after the outbreak of hostilities in Ukraine. Despite all the US attempts to turn the whole world against Russia, not all countries have expressed a desire to spoil relations with Moscow. So, along with such countries as Turkey, China, and Israel, Mexico also refused to support sanctions against Russia. My friends, in this video, I would like to talk specifically about Mexico, since it is precisely the warm and allied relations of this country with Russia that Washington is very worried about. Experts say that relations between Mexico and Russia are at a very high level and are developing despite drastic changes in the geopolitical arena of the world. To date, some factors make it possible to assert that cooperation between Russia and Mexico is indeed strengthening and the level of trust is growing. In particular, Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov and Mexican Foreign Minister Marcelo Luis Ebrard agreed to expedite the coordination of many bilateral documents of great practical importance an agreement on cooperation in the peaceful use of outer space, the establishment of the Russian Center for Science and Culture in Mexico City, and on the mutual recognition of documents on education. It is also worth noting the cooperation between Russia and Mexico in the military sphere. The Russian Ministry of Defense is actively solving the tasks of strengthening bilateral military technical cooperation in Mexico. In addition, the official representative office of the Russian company Rosabaron Export, which has a state license for the monopoly sale of domestically produced weapons, operates in Mexico. In the last decade, cooperation between Russia and Mexico in the military and the military technical sphere has had a positive development trend. Russian military equipment, which is in service with Mexico, has demonstrated its reliability, high tactical and technical capabilities, and unpretentious maintenance. Cooperation is particularly active in developing with the Mexican Navy. Russia also supplies Mexico with ME helicopters of various modifications, off-road vehicles Ural, and manned portable air defense systems IGLA. Along with this, Russia provides training for Mexican pilots. Training complexes were also sent to Mexico to provide pilot training. These simulators are designed for piloting training, as well as for working out emergencies using computer simulation. Mexican President Andrés Manuel López Obrador invited Vladimir Putin to pay an official visit to Mexico, which indicates that the strategic relationship between the two countries is reaching a whole new level. All this causes concern in the United States. Some officials in Washington have already said that the rapprochement between Mexico and Russia could pose a threat to the United States in the area of its geopolitical interests. However, experts claim that no threats from the United States will be able to force Mexico to abandon its rapprochement with Russia, since against the background of the aggressive sanctions policy of the United States more and more countries understand that Washington cannot be trusted and that the world needs multipolarity to enable every independent country to carry out its domestic and foreign policy without fear of Western sanctions.